Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Halloween, so happy Halloween. But I also have a Stitcher stash today. So today, or yesterday actually, last night, <laughs> I used up two balls from my stash, actually from right there. <laughs> and it was two balls of Premier Just Yarn Erin. The color is antique white, so it's like an off-white color. It's a number four worsted way, and there's 112 yards in each ball. I only have one ball band because one ball was missing the ball band. <laughs> but um, it's 100% acrylic. So that's, I grabbed those out of my stash, and I wanted to make something to put in my trick-or-treat bucket for the kids tonight in the neighborhood. So have you ever wondered how many little tiny ghosts you could make out of two balls of just Premier yarn? <laughs> Premier Dust yarn? You can make nine and a half of them. So I'm going to show you roughly all nine of them. And then I'll go through them because I made them a little bit different each of them. So there's nine of them, <laughs> and here's the half. And I'll talk about it in a second. All right. So first, what I did is I held double one, two, and three. These three. So I held double yarn with a H hook, which is a five millimeter hook. Oh, there's a hair on one. There's always hair. I have a lot of hair. <laughs> Uh, so these three I made held double with the H hook and I put safety eyes in them. They're 12 millimeter safety eyes. So those, those three. This pattern, by the way, is a free pattern by Nova at Nova Known Creation. <laughs> I think it's her channel name. I'll link it below. I have it memorized now though. I watched her video and then I was like, okay, I can do that. So I've just been making them without even looking back. It's super, super simple pattern. But it's all one piece, so that's nice. So I made those three held double H hook 5 millimeter. And then I made these four held double with an eye hook, which is a 5.5 millimeter. And I didn't put safety eyes on them, I just stitched little eyes on them. <laughs> so these four are held double with the eye hook. Sissy, Sissy hit the camera. Hold on. <laughs> She's in the floor. Sit right there. So this is eye hook one and this is H hook one. So it is a little bit bigger, but just a little. And then I made two little tiny ones. This one's, these ones are held just one strand, and I used an elf hook, which is a 3.75 millimeter. So they came out little tiny. Two of them. And this is just with one strand. So this is one strand um, elf hook. This is two strand eye hook. <laughs> and this one is two strand H hook. <laughs> so different sizes. And the last ones that I made were the two little ones. She keeps dropping, grabbing the tripod. So I had enough to make almost a whole another one. I got down to the, the ruffle part, and then all, all I needed was two decrease rows. Didn't have enough to do the decreases. But me and Devin was talking, and we think this looks like a little hat. So I'm going to keep this and use it as a little hat on some of my groomy in the future. <laughs> I'll just put it somewhere and on my craft card or something. And uh, when I make a little emigroomy that needs a little hat, I got a cute little hat to put it on, <laughs> to put on it. But, so that took two balls of yarn out of my stash. Look at that, she's right there. You don't need that yarn. I'm try been trying to use up my own yarn without buying any this year. That's why I started doing Stitch Your Stash. Um, and I've done it successfully. I've only purchased two skeins of yarn all year, and it was for my Halloween countdown project. I had to buy two balls of amethyst, right? <laughs> so now I have nine. Now I have nine little ghosts to put in my candy bucket outside, so some of the kids can get a little ghost if they want it. And I also used up two balls of yarn for my sash, and I can also put one more ball band in my little bag of ball bands for this year. And yeah, I guess that's it. I just wanted to hop on here and share that with you guys. Then you can make nine little ghosts out of two balls of Premier Just Yarn. Uh, I could have made a lot more of these little tiny ones, holding them just single, but it would take taken a lot longer. So that's why I decided to hold them double. And um, now, now I just have three different sizes of ghosts. But uh, there's not that many kids that live in the neighborhood. So that should be pretty good for them. Plus all the candy. But yeah. And also a disclaimer about my hair. It looks crazy this morning. I've done brushed it out twice. And it's just not. It's, today's just not the day it's going to behave. It's just going to be crazy here today. But that's okay. I'm just going to throw it up in a blend probably when we go trick or treating tonight. And not worry about it. But I got to hop off here because she's getting angsty. And I got to put these little ghosts in the candy bucket to get ready to set outside in a little while. And I'll see you guys in another video. Bye, guys. Oh, her her uh, pattern will be linked below. Check her out. And her YouTube channel. She's so good and funny. I love watching her. <laughs> but anyways, I'm going to hop off here. And I'll see you in another video. Bye, guys.